bits are these wonderful components that snap together that make things happen. When you walk into a classroom and a student is engaged in a project, authentically, they can tell you what they're doing, why they're doing it, and why it's important. Projects with Little Bits allow students to do that because they can build things and design projects that are exciting to them and meaningful to them. Working with Little Bits, you automatically have a STEAM curriculum. What can you design and make that'll help or solve a problem? Before it was, I can draw that, I can imagine that, but now it's, I can actually make it. Even their vocabulary has changed. They talk about my prototype, my, I mean, third graders talk about, I wasn't talking about prototypes in third grade. Little bits work well with library drop-in programs because they don't require a lot of teaching. It's really just explain the colors, show them how they snap together, and then let them start creating. There is no high learning curve with Little Bits. It's very easy. You can put a suitcase of bits in front of a group of students and they will teach themselves. So we encourage the girls to go onto the Little Bits website and use the Little Bits app for inspiration. But ultimately, it runs itself. It's plug and play. As a principal, I'm looking for products that allow teachers to experiment and to feel successful. One of the challenges with STEM learning and engineering is usually a topic that teachers have not had a lot of training in. So to have a product where the teachers can learn alongside the children is also very powerful. Little Bits help children discover that they're scientists, they're inventors, they're problem solvers, they're artists, and that they're capable of a lot more than they thought. Mm -hmm.